Hi everybody and welcome to this video that we're doing. It's a very special video that we're doing all around tapping for cravings. And I have a very special guest with me today. Anna Johansson is a psychotherapist and she's also my therapist. And we're gonna be using a technique that she's used often with me in our sessions and that she uses with other clients of hers. And do you wanna talk a little bit about what that is? Yeah, it's called tapping or emotional freedom technique. And I use it because it's very effective. And uh, so it saves a lot of time. And now we're gonna use it on cravings. So I talked to Anna about the fact that many of us in this group and uh, many of those of you who subscribe to my newsletter, or who, who watch my videos, you know, we often find ourselves in situations where we have a craving that sometimes feels like it comes out of nowhere, or sometimes we kind of know that we're headed in that direction, but there's this question that comes up of what do I do right there in the moment and sometimes the lists of alternatives that we might have made um, we just can't remember any of them or we don't have time to go out and do some sort of alternative activity and so when i was describing this to anna she said well you know what we could do this tapping that is something that you can use right in the moment if you feel that craving if you've had a long day or a stressful week and you walk through you through your door and you um you know, you open the fridge or, or you have that bottle of wine in the cupboard staring right at you. And this is something that you can use to re reduce the cravings right there in that moment. So I was telling Anna, I actually have had, we're recording this video, it's a Friday. And I actually have had a really stressful week to the point, and this doesn't happen to me very often anymore, but to the point where on Wednesday, I was this close to walking to the store to buy a bottle of red wine. And um, it was it was that kind of, day on Wednesday, it had been a few really challenging days. And so actually when we were talking about doing this exercise, she said, you know, should we have a beer or a wine? And I said, well, for me personally, wine is more relevant. And when she opened it and I smelled it, I thought, you know, wow, this is so perfect that we opened this because this is something that I really actually was craving this week. So uh, you can do it on beer, chocolate or red wine or whatever it is that you're craving. You can imagine it as you see this video, or if you have some open wine or, or a bottle of beer or something, you can take the bottle, like we have it here, so it, you can see it. And it actually is good also if we can pour up some and just smell it. And just smell it and... It smells so. really good. <laughs> Friday. It's Friday. It's, so um, open wine in front of me. Yeah. So, okay. Caitlin, from one to ten, how much would you like to drink a glass of this wine? I would say right now it feels like about an eight for me. So you can do that. Taste it. Like imagine it. Imagine and feel from one to ten. How much do you want? To, to drink it, to feel it, to taste it. And if you don't actually have it right there, but you're experiencing the craving, or if you don't want to open it, which for some of you, it might be a better idea to not yeah. open the bottle of wine. I'm sure as you're watching this and you're looking at our experience around this, you can really get inside of how it would feel to smell it, to taste it. Like you have those sensory memories. So just try to recall the most recent time or recall the experience that you would want to have with that drink of choice instead of actually having it right in front of you. Okay. So shall we start? Yeah. So we start on a point here. It's called the karate chop point. And we use the fingertips to do tapping on that point. We do use four or three fingertips, so we cover that point. And then we repeat, even though, even though I would really like to drink a glass of this red wine. I would really like to drink a glass of this red wine. It smells so good. It smells so good. I deserve this. I deserve this. I had a hard week. I had a hard week. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. Even though. Even though. This wine smells so good. This wine smells so good. I really would like to taste it. I really would like to taste to it. To feel the warmth and relaxation. To feel the warmth and relaxation. I so deserve to drink this wine. I so deserve to drink this wine. 
I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. We can do in the same hand or you can switch hands. Even though. Even though. This wine seems so good. This wine seems so good. I love the smell. I love the smell. I really would like to feel it. I really would like to feel Taste it. it. Taste it. Taste it. Feel the warmth and relaxation. Feel the warmth and relaxation. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. Then we go up here. It's right over the nose where the eyebrow starts and then we do some tapping. Oh, this wine. Oh, this wine. Red wine, it smells so good. Red wine, it smells so good. So rich. So rich. Beside the eyes, I really would like to drink it. I really would like to drink it. To feel the warmth and relaxation. To feel the warmth and relaxation. It's been a hard week. It's been a hard week. I deserve this. I deserve this. It's going to feel so good to drink it. It's going to feel so good to drink it. Under the eyes, on the cheekbones. I really would like to drink this wine. I really would like to drink this wine. I can taste it in my mouth. I can taste it in my mouth. I can feel the warmth and relaxation. I can feel the warmth and relaxation. I just crave drinking this wine. I just crave drinking this wine. Under the nose, I really like to drink this wine. I really like to drink this wine. It's a good wine. It's a good wine. Oh, it smells so rich. Oh, it smells so rich. It's gonna taste wonderful. It's gonna taste wonderful. I look forward to the warmth and relaxation. I look forward to the warmth and relaxation. I deserve this. I deserve it's this. It's been a hard week. It's been a hard week. I just want to relax. I just want to relax. Have some good times. Have some good times. I really look forward to drinking this wine. I really look forward to drinking this it wine. It smells so good. It smells so good. It tastes, and this is like one hand under the arm and where the sore spot is. Yeah, you can do it like this or you can do it like this. I really look forward to drink this wine. I really look forward to drink this wine. Oh, it smells, the smell is so rich. It smells so rich. I look forward to the feeling of warmth and relaxation. I look forward to the feeling of warmth and relaxation. I've been so tense. I've been so tense. I just need to relax. I just need to relax. It's been such a hard week. It's been such a hard week. And now it's Friday. And now it's Friday. And I want to relax. And I want to relax. I just deserve to have a glass of wine. I deserve to have a glass of wine. Or two glasses of wine. Or two glasses of wine. Or a bottle of wine. Or a bottle of wine. I really crave to drink this wine. I really crave drinking this wine. I like the rich taste in my mouth. I like the rich taste in my mouth. I like the warm feeling when it goes down. I like the warm feeling when it goes down. I like how relaxed it makes me feel. I like how relaxed it makes me feel. I really want to drink this wine. I really want to drink this wine. I deserve to have some wine. I deserve to have some wine. The rich smell. The rich smell. The warmth of, the warm feeling. The warm feeling. The feeling of relaxation. The feeling of relaxation. I just want to drink this wine. I just want to drink this wine. Okay, very good. Take a big inhale and exhale. So now from one to 10, how much do you want to drink this wine? Um, I don't know, like I'd say maybe a five or a six. Yeah. I was in a six, uh -huh. and now I think it went down to like a three. Uh -huh. It still, it still smells. Still smells good. <laughs> yeah, but something shifted. It, it, it does smell different, right? It, like smells, it smells like it's sweet to me now. Yeah. It wasn't smelling. It's like I can perceive a different smell. It doesn't, it's funny because I can smell it, but it's almost like it's not connected to my mouth. Uh huh. Like it smells just as good for me, but it's almost like it's a separate feeling. Like before it smelled good and I immediately wanted to put it in my mouth. 
And this mm -hmm. time it's almost like, it's like, oh, that's an aroma, but it's not something that I should be ingesting. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay, but still it's a six? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. So more because I think it's less about the like the, the, the actual smell of it right now, but it's more about the like the feeling is still stuck inside of me, I feel like, you know. The feeling of relaxation. Of wanting the drink, like the feeling of what the drink would give me. And it will give you what? Yeah, that just like that relief, the kind of the release of this the stress of the week of just, you know, having that pause on everything and just kind of being able to like you know okay mm -hmm. even though even though I still want to drink this wine I still want to drink this wine I still really want the release I still really want the release the relief the relief just put a pause on everything and relax just to put a pause on everything and relax I totally love and accept myself I totally love and accept myself just the way I am just the way I am I'm a good person I'm a good person even though even though the wine still smells good. The wine still smells good. I still want to drink it. I still want to drink it. I really want the release. I really want the release. The release from stress. The release from stress. Just put a pause on everything and relax. Just to put a pause on everything and relax. I still want to drink this wine. I still want to drink this wine. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. Even though. Even though. I still want to drink this wine. I still want to drink this wine. I can really feel the release and relaxation it will give me. I can feel the release and relaxation it will give me. I deserve this. I deserve it. I really want to relax and put a pause on everything. I really want to relax and put a pause on everything. Get some stress relief. Get some stress relief. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. I still really want to drink this wine. I still really want to drink this wine. It smells so good. It smells so good. I can just really feel the taste and the warmth and the relaxation. I can really feel the taste and the warmth and the relaxation. It would be so good to get this relaxation and relief. It would be so good to get this relaxation and relief. It's been such a stressful week. It's been such a st stressful week. I really deserve one glass. I really two deserve glasses. one glass or two. <laughs> or three. <laughs> or three. <laughs> or maybe just a whole bottle. <laughs> or maybe just the bottle. Just to get relaxed. The whole bottle. Just to relax. It would be so good. It would be so good. I really look forward to this wine. I really look forward to this wine. To the feeling of release and relaxation. To the feeling of release and relaxation. The warm feeling. The of warm feeling. Red wine. Of red wine. I still really want to drink this wine. I still really want to drink this wine. Okay, good. Big inhale. Exhale. Actually, it's been proved that tapping sends signals. We tap on acupuncture points mm -hmm. and it sends signals to the amygdala, which lowers the cortisol in, in uh, the blood. Mm -hmm. So it will actually release stress. Well, I was just going to say that. I actually feel so much more relaxed right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's like this, what we're doing is giving me the feeling that I thought that I needed from the wine. So the peel of the wine is lessening. Mm-hmm because I feel, I'm feeling super relaxed right now. Yeah. Good. Do you want to still see? It's like, I can't smell it. <laughs> really? Like it doesn't, that is crazy. <laughs> Even from the last time we, like, I, it's like there's a smell, but it doesn't smell like what I, it doesn't yeah. smell good to me anymore. And it doesn't smell like what I smelled last time at all. Yeah. It doesn't and it's smell. almost like my olfactory, like it's like not responding. For me, the, the alcohol in the smell feels irritating yeah. now to my nose. I didn't even notice the alcohol before. And now it's like, yeah, that feels like water. a bit strong. Yeah. <laughs> that feels irritating. Mm -hmm. 
There's actually yeah. no part of me that wants to drink that right now. Like, I think I just went from like a six to a zero. A pretty much. Like, I don't think there's, like, I wouldn't drink that right now. No. <laughs> no. There's a little part of me that's like, well, should I really pour it out? <laughs> like, but it's a good wine. <laughs> I used to think it was a good wine. <laughs> but we can do one short one. If, uh -huh. if you at home there still feel that, well, but I still feel a two and three. Mm -hmm. It went down from nine, ten, eight to two, three. There's still a little part of me that wants a little bit. Mm -hmm. Then we can do the last round with a twist. Sure. Like, even though, even though, there's a part of me. There's a part of me. That still would like to have some red wine. That still would like to have some red wine. I totally accept myself. I totally accept myself. And I love myself just the way I am. And I love myself just the way I am. And I choose not to drink. And I choose not to drink. Tonight. Tonight. Even though. Even though. There's a part of me. There's a part of me. That still says, but you deserve a glass of wine. That or still two. says, but you deserve a glass of wine or two. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. I love and accept that part of me. I love and accept that part of me. But I choose not to drink this wine today. But I choose not to drink this wine today. Even though. Even though. There still is a part of me that would like to drink the wine and get relaxed and get some stress relief. There's still a part of me that would like to drink the wine and feel relaxed and get some stress relief. Or well, maybe to do it because my friends are going to do it. Yeah, or maybe to do it because my friends are going to do it. Because that's what I always do. <laughs> yeah. I totally love and accept myself. I totally love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. And I accept that part of me. And I accept that part of me. And I choose not to drink today. And I choose not to drink today. I can actually have a water, water or something else to drink. I can have water or something else to drink. No, I can't. No, I can't. Everybody's going to drink wine. Everybody's going to drink wine. Water won't do it. Water won't do it. Yeah, wine tastes is nice, but I can actually do without it right now. Yeah, the wine taste is nice, but I can actually do without it right now. Oh, but a glass of wine on oh. Friday. But it's Friday. It's just a glass of wine. What harm will it do? Yeah, but I, I choose not to drink wine today. Yeah, but I choose not to drink wine today. I don't need this wine. I don't need this wine. Yes, I do need this wine. Yes, I do need this wine. I do need to relax. I do need to relax. I need the stress relief. I need the stress relief. Yeah, I can choose to relax in other ways. I can choose to relax in other ways. Maybe I will have a better time. Maybe I'll have a better time. If I'm totally aware and conscious. If I'm totally aware and conscious. Maybe I can relax then in a healthy way. Maybe I can relax in a healthier way. And feel totally clear and good and healthy tomorrow. And feel totally clear and good and healthy tomorrow. <laughs> I choose to relax in other ways. I choose to relax in other ways. Yes, wine can be good. Yes, wine can be good. But I choose not to drink today. But I choose not to drink today. I choose to relax in healthy ways. I choose to relax in healthy ways. I choose not to drink this wine. I choose not to drink this wine. Because I totally love and accept myself. Because I totally love and accept myself. And I choose to take care of myself. And I choose to take care of myself. Very good. Big inhale. Exhale. Good. How did that feel? It felt great. And I'm actually really glad we did it the third time because you might have noticed that I smiled at the end when you said I totally love and accept myself. It's like I really believed it mm. at the end, you know, like I really believed that I was making the best choice for myself in this moment and that by doing so, I was showing myself that love and that respect. Yeah. And it like, it's like, even though my craving went away after the second time, it took, I feel like it, without realizing it even, it took until the third time for me to really believe that last statement. 
that you choose to care and love mm-hmm. and accept yourself mm-hmm. and make the best choices for yourself. Yeah. Good. You want to have a smell of the wine? It should get better when it's aired, but it doesn't smell. No, it's weird. I, it's now yeah. smells almost as sit, like vinegary, like acidic yeah. almost. Like this is crazy. We, I've never, we've never actually done this. We've done tapping on other things before, but we've never done it like this specific for craving around wine. And like this did, I promise you, it smelled really good. Yeah. When we started and I can barely smell it. It's like I have, I feel like I'm shoving my nose in the glass and mm-hmm. all I'm smelling is vinegar. Yeah. I would have no problem. No. Like no pour of me that pouring this out. No problem. <laughs> yeah. Good. So thank you. Yes. And thank I you. hope if you're watching this that you'll give it a try. And so basically just, you know, put yourself in my position and um, and use this to tap along, repeat after Anna. If you feel that you want to insert some of your own words in there, you can do that. And then of course, if you have any questions about it, just, just let us know. But this is obviously just seeing me go through it. It's a, it, I, I wasn't lying when I said it was a really hard week, it was. I had that craving stronger than I felt in a long time on Wednesday night to specifically drink red wine, which I haven't had that craving for a while. And this is a nice bottle of wine and this felt really good when we started. And yeah. so you've just witnessed me have experiencing the power of this technique, of the tapping technique. And, um, and you know, and if anything, it's gonna interrupt that time, you know, to sit and do this and, um, and, and have that reduced cortisol and give yourself the time for relaxation. And even just, you know, we talk sometimes about creating that pattern interrupt and, and giving yourself the opportunity to get off of autopilot and do something else for yourself and try something new. This is, um, it's worth a shot. It's worth a try. You've got nothing to lose. No, it can't go wrong. Mm -hmm. Even if you forget some of the points, it it just can't go wrong. It would work. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, we hope you enjoyed this video. And if you'd like to hear more, or if you have more questions, or you're wondering how you could use this in other scenarios, let us know and we can do more videos for you. Yes. (laughs) Thank you. You're welcome.